Y'all, what's up? It's your boy Peanut coming at you with another reaction. And before we get into this, on this channel, I react to hip hop, music, and anime. And today, we are reacting to Sensei's Kratos, the Multiverse God Fader. Apparently, this video was taken down previously due to age restriction, but now it's back up. We're gonna react to this. Let's get it on. Real quick, real quick, before we get into the video, an announcement, man. I know that y'all used to like when I rapped in the beginning of the videos okay. and all that. And I appreciated all the support that I was getting for those. I have a Spotify now, so I'm going to be dropping raps that, you know, I might have had on the intros. I'm going to be dropping the official songs, all types of stuff. Make sure you click in the link in the pinned comment or description okay. and follow me on Spotify. Run them songs up. I'm about to drop songs this week. I also have a music channel, Sensei Music. Be on the lookout for that. I already dropped two more bangers on there. Go run that up, too. I love y'all. Let's get Let's into go. the video. Grab the show. Yes. We had finally done it. We had defeated all of the gods. And I know that you guys are probably wondering, how do we get here? I'm still wondering that. But after <laughs> I beat Zeus to a pulp, as y'all may remember, I nice. mean, it was kind of bad. I'm not going to lie. You may recall me climbing off of a cliff. Well, I guess y'all can assume that's what happened because I disappeared when the camera panned back. But anyways, I ended mm -hmm. up going to a different realm and I downloaded this dating app. It's like Tinder, but for guys and shit. <laughs> started swiping right because, you know, Nick with no sauce just swipe right on anything. And Back. it was supposed to be a one night stand, but I ended up having a boy. I mean, she was kind of bad, though. I mean, well... She was all right. I mean, I didn't really know what she looked like. Oh, no. Because I was swiping right so fast. But that's neither near or there. But my point is, we're in another realm, and this is a new story. The story of Kratos trying to be a father once again. Because okay. Nick, my track record is trash. I mean, it, it is what it is. Freak. Strap in, get your snacks once again. Because this snacks. is the continuation of Kratos, the fader of gods. Yo. All right, y'all. So, so as you can hear from the intro, <laughs> I ain't going to lie. You feel me? Our boy Kratos is back, but we in a whole different story this time. And okay. man, this game is kind of crazy, bro. So this entire video is going to be based on God of War 4. I told you guys if you got 8,000 likes and 100,000 views, Let's then I would do this video. And y'all, at this point, have gotten over 20,000 likes and over 400,000 views on that video. Like, I don't understand how y'all are supporting me this much, but hey, I appreciate it so much. God damn. Um, I will say this, though. You if you guys want to go up, up, in a way, on some Superman shit, you feel me? Like I said before, like, <laughs> hey, and support me even more. Make sure that you go on that pinned comment. I got a Twitch link. I stream every day. I play games. And I got a gaming channel down there. Make sure you Make click on that link and subscribe him, and turn on your post notifications for that, right too, yo, Because yo, I ain't gonna lie. We're taking it up this year. But yeah. that's neither near or there. The game starts off, and we're cutting down a tree. Now, I'm not gonna lie. I thought I was gonna be smoking God straight out the gate, because that's just what I'm used to. But right. I, I guess we don't turn into a glorified lumberjack i don't have my chaos blades i got this thing called a leviathan axe and it's just some frosty ass axe i mean this shit literally reminded me of like some ice age shit. like like you can see the cold air coming off this oh motherfucker bro i ain't gonna lie to you but i'm cutting down a tree and i soon realized that this kratos has another kid and i ain't gonna hold y'all i instantly got scared because y'all know that this track record with kids is terrible yes, i mean look is. at his skin it's like that because his daughter's ashes are on them bro at this point you gotta get a paternity test if i was him i would have went to mari in today's case of <laughs> The son of Kratos and the son of Faye. Kratos, you are the father. Man, that's a boo. That little nigga don't even look like me. That's not my kid. What the fuck you talking about? I'm eight foot tall. This is three foot two. This little I ain't gonna hold you, bro. After what I did to my daughter and my wife back in the first game, yo. Ain't no way I would have tried to take care of another little nigga. But anyways, we taking this little hunt for the tutorial. This is where you learn about all the controls and shit. That's not important, though. We're not here to talk about game mechanics. We are here to talk about how this nigga Kratos be spazzing on this nigga Atreus. Atreus is his son, by the way. Bro, I'm not gonna lie, bro. The first thing we do is we hit this nigga a bow, and he's trying to basically shoot down this animal, this deer. Okay. You feel me? And he missed. He get all mad. Kratos is mad at him, shaking him. I'm like, yo, if you don't calm down, you go f*** around get that nigga a concussion. You shaking that hard as hell talking about you have to be better. You have to be good. I'm like, nigga, relax. Not everybody gets to grow up and fight their younger brother and get Sparta, man. This I might not know what to do with a weapon. Man, look, this is bad parenting already, man. Come on, most kids these days look up to their father, man. To teach them everything in life from right from wrong. The proper tools to survive in this crazy world that we live in, man. This is crazy. Clearly it doesn't, because you're talking about he's not ready. Like, maybe if you just shout for him, I'm like, damn. 
Anyway, right. you shoot at Bambi and sh he missed. I ain't gonna lie. Bambi, he done dipped off. So we gotta go chasing after this motherfucker there. We finally get to him and get a good shot, yo. And I ain't gonna lie, you hit this nigga. But he's not dead. This nigga is on his way out, though. This nigga is down on the ground, though, looking like the Jordan symbol. This deer is fucked up. Mm. Deer, like, uh, making noises and shit. <laughs> it sound like a walking dead zombie. Oh, so you go up to him and this nigga Kratos is like, you have to finish what you kill. And I'm like, right. what you mean finish what you kill? Nigga's still alive. <laughs> so, of course, you got this knife in your hand. This little shaky ass nigga Atreus is trying to cut this deer. And he's like, I can't do it. Soft ass. Like, bro, you can shoot the nigga in this motherfucking torso, but you can't slit his throat. At least put it out to misery. I ain't gonna Come lie, on, bro. Man. Last time I hit a deer, I felt terrible because I kept driving. Like, 30 minutes passed. I'm on the freeway. And I'm like, damn, I probably should have killed that deer because that nigga's probably just limping in the field somewhere, bleeding out. Like, ain't nobody coming to revive this nigga nope. deer was laying in the field with no quick revive, bro. I ain't gonna lie. But anyways, Kratos takes the knife and he ends up slitting this deer's throat. And I learned a valuable lesson here. One, this nigga Kratos is still savage. And two, this Atreus is a soft-ass bitch. Yep. Well, at least for now. Okay. After this happens, though, we run into a giant, right? And I ain't gonna lie. When I first seen this nigga, he didn't have no regular club. This nigga had a pillar on his back. It looked like this nigga had a fucking building, a skyscraper. Like, what is this big-ass block? Where did you get that from? He's swinging this shit at us. I'm trying to weave, weave. I ain't gonna lie. You end up killing this shit. And yo, the way that this nigga savagely kills giants in this game, like he grabs this weapon and he uses it to crush his head. Once again, this nigga Kratos, just like in a Hercules fight from God of War 3, using another nigga's weapon. Yep. Bro, you know you a demon when you use a nigga's weapon against him. Especially if you're using it to kill him. Like, uh, exactly. man. After this, we return home, wow. yo. We go to bed, but we arguing first. I ain't gonna lie. This is one of many arguments, yo. This nigga Atreus and this nigga Kratos be going back and forth this whole game. This nigga Atreus get mad, and every time he get mad, this nigga has an asthma attack. Like, bro, I don't think he's sick. This nigga probably just has asthma. Get this probably. nigga an inhaler. This and he's a rescue inhaler or something. Him and Kratos in there arguing and shit. This <sighs> Start wheezing right and now, coughing and shit. Him blood out coming fight. out of his mouth. That's not normal. Why is that nigga coughing up blood? That shit don't even make any sense. So eventually, this nigga calms the fuck down, bro. And y'all go to get some rest. But then we hear a big ass knock on the door. Who the heck is that? I ain't gonna lie. I sounded like I might have been a raid in this bitch. I'm like, Kratos, go and flush them drugs, my nigga. Cause I ain't gonna lie. That's probably 12. <laughs> so they keep banging. <laughs> not 12. I know you're in there. I'm like, first off, is this nigga Scottish? Like, what is going on here? And then he opens the door up. And the first thing I see is a nigga that look like he's in the Aryan Brotherhood. I mean, yep. this nigga has more prison tasks than Baker Mayfield. I ain't know if that nigga was going to be somebody from mythology or a nigga that... <laughs> I said that Baker Mayfield. That is terrible. Speaking of Baker, he's down bad. Horrendous right now, man. Hopefully he finds a team that wants him one day, bro. I was playing as Sons of Anarchy, bro. This nigga has so many goddamn tattoos on him. It's like somebody just started scribbling on this nigga when they were bored. But this is this nigga Barter, bro. And Barter is invincible and he can't feel pain. So as you can tell, we had a lot of trouble with this nigga for a long time in this game. I'm not going to lie. Like, this okay. goddamn this nigga. But anyways, he keeps trying to provoke Kratos, bro. He's getting him to come outside. And he starts punching this nigga, though. Like, but it was like big slap punches. It was like big hit. Blink it, Dang. Blink it. Eventually he goes to do it again and Kratos grabbed this nigga arm. This is the moment where I said, Oh yeah, you know this nigga Kratos about to turn up. He is not playing with this nigga. Yes, sir. This nigga, the ghost of Sparta is back. He rocks this nigga. Boom! I'm like, oh shit. Woo. And then Barter does it. This nigga looks at himself, touches his face, and he's like, That's all you got? I was expecting. Boom! Hits this nigga Kratos so hard, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I've never seen an eight foot tall nigga fly over a building like that. This nigga uppercutted us over our entire your house. Yeah, the whole fight had to go to backyard wrestling away. This nigga put us in the backyard. Bro. I was like, God damn. So we get back there, start to mixing this nigga up. Dook up, dook up, dook up. Weave, weave. We start fighting this nigga. I ain't gonna lie. The axe is doing some damage. I'm like, okay, okay. We get this nigga health bar all the way down. Bro, tell me why this nigga sit there in his resolve. The scars start healing. And his motherfucking health bar comes back. I'm like, oh no, nah, this nigga's different, bro. Heck this nigga's no. right here in front of us. He's like, bro, it's no good. I don't feel any of that. I'm like, oh what? nah. Nigga, you don't feel it? Not only are you in Invincible, immortal. You don't feel pain too. <sighs> ain't no way I'ma keep fighting this. Nigga. But we did, yo. I ain't gonna lie. But so we get to scrapping this nigga again. But now we in a whole different area. And finally, the rage mode kicks in because this nigga Kratos done had enough. Mm -hmm. <sighs> had to turn up. Do, 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 had to turn up. Super Saiyan. We started hitting this nigga with the Tyson combos, bro. We was punching this nigga fast as shit. Bro, eventually we <laughs> ran this nigga to a wall. Pause. That was crazy. Oh. And we end up dropping the wall on him. Boom, bro. I'm starting to walk away. I'm thinking the fight is over. And he's like, now where are you going? He gets back up, he attacks us again. So now we got a whole nother health bar. I'm like, bro, this is the third time I done had to get rid of your health bar. And they're like,
like, what the f***? How many extra lives do you have? How many one-ups did you find? Yeah, a lot. Especially, like, we put this in a chokehold. I'm like, okay, fine. We can't kill this n***a. Let's choke him out. We get the rolling. We get the tussling. Got and to. finally, this n***a Kratos breaks this n***a's neck and throws him in his crater. And I'm like, mm. damn, we just smoked a n***a that can't die. This n***a Kratos is the ghost. Yes, sir. Just keep that in mind, but. Anyways, we finally go back to the house, yo, and at this point, Kratos is like, nigga, pack your shit up. We gotta go, bro. Grab the backpack, the mat on, on our door explore shit. We gotta get up out this bitch, bro. It's no longer safe here. So now we're traveling, bro, and I'm like, oh my god, bro. Traveling with this little nigga Atreus in this game is annoying, bro. This nigga, if you don't shut the fuck up, damn. So in this game, we got these, like, zombie-type joints. I forgot what they're called, like, Dwelvers, Dwell, some shit like that. I don't know, bro. The names in this motherfucker game that i'm gonna have to try to pronounce bro god damn man why do y'all it's kind of crazy but anyways we end up fighting some bandits and shit so we find these what bandits and i'm like oh it's actually people that's alive in this game i had no idea i thought it was just gonna be dead people and shit we smoked these bandits and then it turned to dead people and shit i'm what? like god damn Felt like walking dead all over again. Every time you kill somebody, bro, you got to make sure you hit them in the brain, yo. You feel me? Or they just going to come back. Yeah. So these guys come back and we smoke them. After this, we get to this bridge. This is where we first meet this nigga Brock, bro. And I ain't going to lie. This nigga Brock looked like that one nigga from Guardians of the Galaxy, the oh. Whistler. He oh. do look like that a little bit. I ain't going to lie, bro. But, but the nigga name is Brock, and he is a weapons master. He's like a dude, uh, not a weapons master. Uh, what the shit's called? Blacksmith. He's like a blacksmith. Yeah. Master. Him and his brother, Sindri, who will meet later, apparently made this Leviathan ass that we have. He's like, yeah, I made Jacks, there's a thing on the handle. So we look, and I'm like, oh, shit, on us. Did they make it? You feel me? I ain't gonna lie, but he told us he was gonna upgrade it and shit. But okay. we see this big ass horse on the bridge, bro. Now I ain't gonna lie, this don't look like a regular ass horse. This shit is ugly as hell. It's a mutated ass horse. Like, what is going on with it? It looked like a seahorse mixed with like some sort of like spider. Like, it was disgusting. This scared as hell on the bridge, though. Some shit in the trees. So we gotta go through that whole situation. And apparently, this nigga Atreus is a zoologist or something, or Ace Ventura <laughs> pet detective. He's talking to the horse and shit. Man, say Ace Ventura pet detective. Man, shout out to Jim Carrey. If you know, you know, man. Let's go. God damn, bro. That don't make any goddamn sense. Anyways, what he was afraid of was another giant. There's another fucking giant we gotta end up fighting. <sighs> Once again, punish this nigga. Use the block to smash this nigga's head. At this point, I'm okay. like, bro, these niggas need to stop using blocks. Pick up something else softer, like a pool noodle or something, because we gonna keep using it to kill you. <laughs> then we find this board, bro. Now, this ain't no regular ass board. When I seen this board, this one of those big ass boards, like one of those wild boards you find like in the south somewhere that you can't kill with a shotgun. Them motherfuckers you gotta have like an AR-15 or something for that motherfucker. Damn. A 50 cal for that motherfucker. Bro, that's a big ass board. One of them joints. You feel me with the tusk and shit? Bro, I am not playing, bro. That's motherfucker remind me of the Nemean board. Nigga, that was a big ass joint. Then I started thinking about, damn, if we smoke this nigga, we can eat for a while. Kratos had the same idea. He like, all right, right. we about to hunt this nigga. I'm like, I don't know, man. That's a big motherfucker, bro. But we end up chasing him and shit. Now, when we get close to this board, I realize this is a magical ass board. This nigga got tattoos like that nigga border. I'm like, bro, what are y'all in the same gang? Like, what, what is going on here? <laughs> Uh, Orlo, like he like to say the n-word like he gonna host you we end up shooting this nigga though and that's when we meet this bitch Frey bro this witch of the forest I ain't gonna lie she live in Groot house or something she live in this big ass tree trunk motherfucker live in Winnie the Pooh house like this shit is crazy but anyway she yeah, shows up and she's like oh my god that's my friend why did you guys do this he's the last of his kind and I'm like bro shut your hippie ass up don't nobody care about no goddamn boar you talking about he's the last of his kind I'm gonna come all the way clean I might be the last person on earth that cares about what you think and I'm not I don't care that's so this man the Trayus though got me pissed off in this part though, man. Cause this nigga do not know how to keep his mouth shut, bro. He one of those niggas you tell him a secret, bro. He's telling everybody. It's, oh, it's like a Lord. game of telephone. He's telling her everything about our mom, what we plan on doing. We're trying to go to Yodomhan to land up. You see, see, you gotta be careful who you have in your inner circle, man. People love to talk, man. People love to talk. That's why I keep your circle nice and small, man. Gotta do it. Can't trust everybody in this world. Of Yodelheim? Yodelheim? I don't know. Anyways, the land of the giants to get to this big ass thing to put these ashes. But we don't know at the time we're getting to Yodelheim. We're really on the way to where, like, Mamir is. That's a whole nother nigga you're going to learn about when we get to that part. But, like, man. Anyways, this nigga is just running his mouth too much. He's on some gossip and shit, bro. Small nigga, bro. Telling her everything. Kratos, of course, tells this nigga to shut the f up. But he don't nigga, keep talking. As soon as we get to our house, though, she asked this little nigga to go to the garden to get her something. She started giving us the third degree, talking about, hey, I know that you a god and shit. You feel me? 
money. And I'm like, excuse me, like, mind your up your business, mind the business that pays yours, you feel me? Exactly. Why is you telling me about some shit that I don't want my son to know about? She's talking about, he needs to know. It's gonna come back to haunt you. It's gonna hurt him. I'm like, bitch, have you ever heard of that figure of speech, what he don't know won't kill him? Like, right. man, if you don't shut your ass up, she all in my <laughs> pussy, boy. So after this, though, we can't save this board. We gotta go get this stupid ass ingredient. I'm like, oh my God, bro, why are we even doing this for this board? Who cares? So we get in this boat to go find this ingredient, bro. We see all these Seems big like ass statues work, of gods and quest, all this man. stuff, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. But, bro, we end up running into this big ass Orochimaru ass, bro, the world serpent. First thing I think when I see this is like, I'm like, yo, somebody don't get a roach tomorrow, summon and juice you the fuck out of here. Like, what is this big ass serpent? <laughs> that nigga's so goddamn big, bro. When he moved, like when he got out the water, the water level fell. I'm like, oh, nah, this nigga different. What we end up having to use this thing called the Bifrost to travel to a whole nother world and like phrase with us. It's, it's, it's complicated, bro. It, basically, this thing, there's like bridges and it moves the bridge and it goes to different realms and you need okay. rooms to get. St it's, it's stupid, bro. I, it, 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 it doesn't matter. Literally, it doesn't matter. But we see this thing. Brock again, but right. it's cool. Because I do like that Brock. Like, he's a cool n bro. Like, it is what it is. So we're finally on the way to where we're supposed to be going, and we meet this in his gold armor, bro. And I'm like, who the f is this n bro? Mm -hmm. My like he about to pull Excalibur out of a rock. If this nigga don't get his bronze kneecap armor the fuck out of here, but it ends up being this bitch Sendry, who is the brother of, you feel me, Brock. They yeah. work together, but they got the issues right now. They not really fucking with each other. I ain't gonna lie. But this nigga Sendry is soft, bro. He's a germaphobe ass. He wants to hold this Leviathan axe to work on it, but he's like, oh, it's dirty. He starts gagging when he touches it. I'm like, bro, calm down. He's like, it's that blood, blood. He starts gagging. So I'm like, bro, calm down. Damn. Stick it on my damn nerves. I ain't gonna lie to you. He's a scary ass bro. But that doesn't even matter. Neither near there. So a giant ran weapon. up on us, though, after we meet Sentry, yo. This man, the trans kind of went crazy, stabbed this nigga in the eye. I'm like, okay, hold on. This nigga trans turned this giant to the pirate from SpongeBob. Like, I ain't gonna lie. Army made his head ass stabbed then his eye. I'm going through the glass eye now, like that Debo. I ain't gonna lie. So we get past this giant, we end up getting Friday, to the royal tree, South and we use the Bifrost roughly. to get to Elfheim. Now I ain't gonna lie, Elfheim got some nasty, weird ass niggas here. I ain't gonna hold you. These niggas, oh, we gonna talk about it when we get there. But that's neither near there. So this motherfucker Freya, she can't be here. As soon as she gets in here, bro, they send her ass back to Midgard. Apparently she's cursed or something. I have no idea, bro. We get in the boat, we start traveling. Now we on the way there to get this thing for this board, and this okay. Atreus turns to YMW Melio. This nigga hearing voices and shit. Like, I got murder on my mind. I got split personality. <laughs> like, this nigga is really in the boat. Like, hearing shit. He like, Dad, did you hear that? I'm like, no. What you talking about? I ain't hear shit, boy. Like, like bro, you, you sure you ain't hear that? I'm like, no. I didn't hear shit. Like, I ain't gonna lie. This nigga in the boat having a midlife crisis. I'm like, bro, you gotta calm down. So we end up pulling up to this, like, ruin type joint. And it's like all these it's different, like, kids. And they got hearts. And you gotta, like, freeze them and break them and shit. That's just not important. But we run into the enemies of this realm. These my Elfheim ass warrior ass bro. Now these niggas have, you know, names, but not specific names, and I forgot. I ain't gonna lie to y'all, but y'all know who I'm talking about. These niggas look like Beetle Boys. I ain't gonna lie. They okay. showed up with wings and shit. Motherfucker look like Venom off. I'm like, bro, if you don't calm the fuck down, motherfucker out here looking like hair across and shit, like you know, <laughs> flying around and shit. Like I'm about to get a bug zapper for y'all niggas. So we end up going rage mode on this one part, bro. We on the bridge. We punching through these insects. We bling it, bling it, bling it. Weave, weave. Bing, 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 bing. I ain't gonna lie. We turning the insecticide. Bro, we out here putting these <laughs> down. I was punching those so hard. These bitches was disintegrating. They was turning into bug ashes. Somebody wrote these bitches up in that side. Motherfucker looking like Yamega and shit. But anyways. Yamega. This goes to this one, like, light area where we're supposed to go to get this thing. It's called the light or something like that. But this okay. thing starts hallucinating, right? And he sees his son talking crazy about him in this hallucination like i ain't gonna lie eventually this atreus pull us out though and he's like boy what happened why did you do that he's mad because we seen Faye, like our wife and shit and he's like dad you were gone for a long time he's like i was only gone for a minute he said no you were gone for a long time we look around it's hella dead beetle boy ass and shit this atreus the smoke this whole time while i'm gone i ain't gonna lie like father like son i was so proud of this little soft ass in this moment so we go downstairs and we got the day we need to leave and then the boss ass to show up this his name is Fort Tar Joe Far. What? Something like that, bro. I'm gonna call this nigga Swart. Yo, we fight this nigga Swart. Yo, I ain't gonna lie. This nigga really look like a mega hair cross, bro. This nigga is nasty as hell. Big swole ass nigga. He had the body shape of like Shao Kahn, but he had motherfucking wings on his back. I ain't gonna lie, yo. He looked like that one Digimon from the first season. You remember the little short nigga with the orange oh. shirt he had on? Oh. Uh, Pokemon, I forgot what that nigga was called. Throwback. Yeah, but yeah. But you know what I'm talking about? I'm <laughs> the beetle ass. <laughs> they got a horn and shit. I ain't gonna lie, though. It don't even matter. That's the only thing in the order. Ah. This 
that name sound like a Mad Lib, though. Like, bro, if you don't get your mother scrambled ass letters, the f bro, like, what kind of name is that? <laughs> Anyways, we end up smoking this nigga and it use his own like club to puzzle, smack man. this <laughs> and stab him in the stomach. I'm like, bro, this Kratos is the god of using other weapons yeah, against him at this is. point. I mean, the fader, guys, that's your new epithet. You the other weapons, nigga. Bro, this is crazy. So we end up right, going to go, baby. Here, and he's like, boy, read this. I ain't gonna lie, yo. This nigga trail started talking heavy, bro. He's like, boy, read this. Boy, do that. It's like, all you do is use me. You only talk to me when you need me to do something. I'm like, oh my God, yo, shut your soft ass up. We ended up traveling back, though. We're back in Midgard, but we're going through, like, caves of the giants, apparently, because we got to get to Freya's house. We got to get to Groot's house and shit, this big-ass tree or whatever she live in. Motherfucker live in a forest and shit. Like, bro, if you don't get your bug catching that. So anyways, we walk past all of this, and I'm thinking, okay, the coast is clear. We're probably almost there. And then we run into a thunder dragon, what? bro. This I don't know if it's really a thunder dragon or a wyvern. I don't know what kind of thing it is, but it's a creature and it shoots thunder and it looks like a dragon. Bro, why is he look like one of the creatures from Lord of the Rings, bro? I swear on God. Dragon, bro, I'm not gonna lie. This nigga's name is crazy. His nigga name is Hezryla. Hezryla? I think the H gotta be silent, but it's H R E Z Y L A. Like, bro, if you don't get your dumb ass, yo, what's up with these dumb ass names? <laughs> sound like Skyrim names. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. Remember the part where you learn to shout when you go, what's up? Like, bro, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> so we end up jumping up and smacking this nigga, but he start trying to give me that gawk gawk. Start trying whoa. to bite me and shit. I'm like, yo, get whoa, your mouth somewhere. Whoa, I ain't gonna lie. Start hitting this nigga. Whoa, this whoa, whoa, pause. Pause that go go bro. Pause. I'm though. I can't take shit now. I got COVID. Like I ain't gonna lie. We beating the shit out of his tongue. Blicka, 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 blicka. And we start throwing these crystals at this nigga. I ain't gonna lie, these crystals are exploding. I don't know where they came from or what they are, but they got power in them, apparently, from what Kratos was saying. And when they make contact with something, they explode. So we're throwing okay. motherfucking explodey ass things at his mouth. And eventually he falls down. I start working his eye. I don't know what's up with me and my son taking his eyes out, yo, but we was fucking his eye up. Blick it, blick it, blick it. We can walk up, make it, mock up, move up. Yo, we start punishing his eye. Bro, look like Odin right now. You don't need an eye patch, too. So he's mad as hell at this point. He starts shooting his motherfucking thunder at us. But it's like an aura to this thunder. It's some radioactive shit. Bro, why you like fight like Electro when the hawk had a baby. I ain't gonna lie. Isn't it? <sighs> thunder exploding everywhere and shit. But it was like radioactive. I'm like, oh, nah, I ain't touching that shit. Fuck around, get cancer or something. Like, yo, we got me fucked up. Right. Eventually, me and the boy, Atreus, we see this big ass crane. And I'm like, hold on now. He ended up climbing up on this crane and he pulled that shit down like it's the crane game or something. We grabbed this yep. neck. I'm like, okay, what we got to do? And then I seen this big ass crystal stab into this neck. I'm like, God damn. Not only did we get rid of this taste, we got rid of this ability to swallow. He can't taste or eat now. It fell mouth first on top of me, though. I ain't gonna lie, say, yo, you better close that mouth. You feel me? <laughs> so Sentry pulls up. He's like, oh my god, you guys killed a dragon for me. I'm like, you don't shut your dumb ass, shiny ass up. No, ain't nobody killed this dragon for you. But he ends up giving us some these like green arrows, emerald ass arrows. I don't know. Okay. And he makes us turn into a dentist as we had to take out this dragon's tooth. I felt bad. I'm, I'm like, damn, his mouth was relatively clean. Clean. He probably ain't even have no cavities. We take this nigga tooth out. We put it on the bow. I'm like, okay, so what's this about to do? And then my nigga Atreus started shooting thunder arrows. I said, oh, this nigga different. Okay. The work. So we finally get to this motherfucking summit after this. <laughs> and we start climbing up, man. And we see this Boulder, Maggie, and Modi, motherfucking three stooges talking to this nigga on a tree who is Mamir. Now, okay. Mamir, he's a cool nigga. He's the dude that knows, like, everything. I ain't gonna lie. He's a real nigga for real. So we get up there, and they start talking to him, and he's like, bro, I don't know shit. I don't know nothing. I don't know what y'all, you know, thought I knew. What? but I, I don't. You know what I'm saying? I don't know nothing. I'm like, okay. He's talking kind of heavy to these we like, we gonna come back and get y'all. I'm like, damn, this nigga missing the eye too? Like, who else is missing the eyes? So we go talk to this nigga and we start asking him questions too. And he tells us that we gotta go to the realm of the giants to spread our ashes because that's where the highest thing is. Okay. He also tells us that this nigga gets tortured every day and Odin does it personally. And I'm like, bro, what kind of sick ass nigga is Odin? This nigga comes here to torture and stuck in a tree with one eye? I'm like, God damn, that's this nigga's not playing. So my son is off doing some shit. I don't know. He's on the corner. That nigga Atreus is always going in the most convenient times because this nigga Momir is talking to me. He's like, hey, I know you a god. I know you from another place. You got to tell your son. This nigga Kratos is like, bro, how many times y'all niggas going to tell me that? I don't want to tell this nigga shit. Nope. And then this nigga Momir was talking heavy to me. He's like, man, what you value your privacy more than your son? I was like, bro, I'm about to leave this nigga in the tree, bro. This nigga got me fucked up. Man, anyways, wow. we Wow. Value your privacy more than your son. That's cold, bro. That is cold bloody. Oh, man. This nigga Momir with us, so we cut his nigga's head off, and we are going to take his head to Freya to get him reanimated. First and foremost, 
how does that even work? Like, well, anyways, I ain't gonna question that shit. We end up taking this nigga to the witch, and she resurrects this nigga's head. And I'm like, the moment you're kind of annoying. Nigga. All this nigga keep doing is talking. So we gotta get to the world serpent, and you know, this nigga talks a whole different language. But thankfully, Momir is the smartest man alive and can speak literally every tongue in the realms. This nigga start talking to the snake. <laughs> I'm gonna translate for y'all. Uh -oh. The snake was like, hey, my nigga Momir, what the fuck it is, dummy? Momir was like, I ain't even gonna hold you, guys. You know what I'm saying? We gotta get by and shit. The snake was like, man, what the fuck you mean you gotta get by? We just got here. Nigga, what's up, gang gang? We lit. Nigga, turn up. Gang Smoke gang. Something. Nigga, roll something up. I can't even do that <laughs> for you right now. You feel me, my s Nakey friend, you know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't gonna lie, I need to get by you, you feel me? Like, don't make me call a Rochimaru up. This nigga, like, oh, calm down now. <laughs> I don't wanna fool that nigga Rochimaru no more. Last time the nigga was here, he summoned me, I ain't gonna lie. He had me doing some weird shit with Sasuke. Yeah, I'm not with that. He was like, I got you, nigga. I'm gonna go ahead and move this shit for you right now. So we move this shit for us. We run to a whole nother place. We end up running to a motherfucking wolf dude. I ain't gonna lie, this nigga looking like the dude off the cover of Dog, nigga. Like, <laughs> like your main character of Dog, nigga. Like, we fighting werewolves and shit. After we smoke this motherfucking nigga, bro. We ran into this nigga the mirror. The nigga that got smoked by Thor. I ain't gonna lie. He got this big ass chisel on his head and shit. I'm like, God damn, okay. are you good? But apparently this nigga Thamir, like he was a real nigga. You feel me? He was for the peoples. You feel me? He just had an untimely death. I don't know how Thor got his big ass chisel on his head. Thor not even that big. Like, nigga, what'd you use thunder to do it? You picked it up. Like, I don't know, man. That nigga must be strong as hell though. I'm not, not trying to fight that nigga Thor. I ain't gonna lie. So we nope. run into Sindri nope. after this though. This my shiny armor ass nigga. This soft ass nigga, gagging ass nigga. He ends up throwing an apple at us. I'm like, bro, why are you throwing food? at us. You one of the most germaphobe ass niggas ever, but you just throwing food at us? I don't know where this apple been. Like, do I look like a produce thing? Why is you throwing it at me? So he's telling us that he can teleport and shit. And he's gonna teach us how to do it, basically. Which is all fine and dandy. But uh, that's neither me or there, because the next part, we ain't teleport shit. We walked, and then we seen Magni and Modi, and I'm like, god damn, bro, these motherfuckers it's big as hell, I ain't gonna lie. That motherfucker Magni especially, he got this big ass bastard sword, got a gut sword and shit. I'm uh -oh. like, god damn. So we start scrapping this nigga, I ain't gonna lie. This nigga was on Atreus' ass, bro. He called this nigga a half-breed. I said, yo, damn, this nigga was talking crazy about my wife and his mom. He called this nigga's mom ugly. Like, Faye was an ugly ass bitch, I ain't gonna lie. And you a half-breed little nigga, mixed breed ass nigga. I'm like, yo, calm down. Damn. That nigga told Atreus, what you get them face cuts at from your mom? Face cut up as hell, nigga. Face like a checkerboard, nigga, like you got in a fight with cheese grater. <laughs> He says his face like a checkerboard. What the? <laughs> oh, shoot. I'm weak. Face first. I'm like, God damn. So this nigga trans got mad started rushing him. This nigga grabbed this nigga whole body, though. I'm like, oh, my God. Hit this nigga in the stomach. So after the fight, you know, goes on forever and ever, and we get right. their health bar down low enough, you get to the final phase, bro. And I ain't gonna lie. We did this nigga Maggie dirty. Hit this nigga in the stomach. Boom. And then we stabbed this nigga. Dead in his forehead, I mean, that nigga Modi was so mad. I am not gonna lie, so I will never forgive you for this. So after this, we go to Tears Vault, and this nigga Modi show up, mad as hell, started shocking Kratos. I'm like, oh shit. So this nigga Treyas get mad as hell, Whoa. he start trying to intervene and, and pass out. We went into rage mode, started punishing this nigga, punch him in the wall. Bigger, bigger, Mickey Maka, Mooka Maka. This nigga start running like, oh my god. This nigga's a demon. But this nigga Atreus is knocked the fuck out, so we gotta take this nigga to Freya. And she told us we gotta go to the realm of the dead to get the heart of this keeper to save this nigga. What? I'm like, the heart of what? what? Bro, I don't wanna fight no nigga called the keeper of the bridge of the damn. Bro, I'm good off that. <laughs> this nigga is keeping the dead in check, bro. That's basically like fighting Hades all over again. Exactly. But we still gotta pull up to this nigga, but she told us yeah, our false acts ain't gonna work. The Leviathan ain't gonna work. So I'm looking at my wrist, and I see this motherfucker rolling on. I mean, the, 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 the Sparta symbols. I mean, I don't know, Richard Millie? I don't know what it is for real. But anyways, it's it doesn't even matter. We use this shit to open up this vault, bro. And in the vault is the Blades of Chaos. They are back. The chain link weapons themselves. Oh my god, I was so excited when I got these back. I was like, I'm about to smoke for real. Yes, On the way sir. back, though, my fucker Athena popped up, started playing mind games with me. She's sitting in the boat looking at me and shit. I'm like, bitch, if you don't get your weird ass somewhere, always trying to talk to me about this and that and this and that. You want the power of hope and all that. You want to change the world. Yeah. You just want to be Zeus. Lame ass bitch. She's so selfish. Like, leave me alone. I'm in a whole nother realm. Go do something. Don't you got something to do? <laughs> weird ass bitch. <laughs> Anyways, we end up pulling up on the keyboard of Bridge of the Dam, and this nigga look like a jack hybrid. I ain't gonna lie, this nigga got tusk and shit looking like an elephant nigga, bro. What? what the name is? Mott to get her house in. I said, Mott to get her house in. What? Nigga, like, Van Helsing? Like, Van Helsing? House and Ultimate nigga? Nigga name dumb as hell, so we end up fucking this nigga up, yo. We need his fucking his tusk. Boom, the tusk come off. I'm like, oh shit. Try to use his pillar too, just like every other giant, but it ain't work. So we just end up stabbing this nigga dead in his forehead. I'm like, god damn. Then we rip through this nigga body. Talking about, oh, this is the messy part. Yeah, I bet, nigga, because we ripping through this nigga. Hey, order. we pull this heart 
out. We about to leave. This nigga Zeus pop up talking about Kratos. I'm like, whoa, whoa, what the fuck? This is the second guy that I've seen from a different round. What is going on? Motherfucker, Momir talking about, oh, nah, it's just an illusion. Don't pay it no mind. I'm like, pay, don't pay it no mind. That's Zeus. <laughs> we end up leaving, though. We got to go talk to my son, though, because, yeah, we healed him. But we got to tell him about being a guy so he can be fully good. I'm going to translate okay. that for y'all real quick. Uh -oh. <laughs> Yo, son, I got to tell you some real shit, though. What's going on, Dad? Like, son, man, I know you feel me. You probably been wondering why you got all these powers and shit. Yeah, I've been wondering, Dad. Like, I'm like, I keep coughing and shit. Like, I don't know what's going on. Like, why I sound like peanut live right now? Like, I'm like, son, I don't even know, bro. I, you feel me? But, but that's besides the point, man. You a god, nigga. You feel me? You not no regular ass nigga. You a god. Yeah. Dad, what the fuck you mean? I'm a god. Like, that's what I said. You a god, bro. You're like, you not a human being. Like, you not a regular person. Seeing it, nigga, it's working. The denim, the denim, you feel me? On the eight buggy shit, you feel me? You not a regular person. You a god. So, Dad, I got powers and shit. Like, I can shape shift and all that. Like, I can do... I don't know what you can do, nigga. You just not... You just a god, nigga. Like... Man, I ain't gonna lie. I knew it was more important than these little niggas, man. I knew that. So, at this point, I'm like, oh, man, this man having a goddamn crisis, you feel me? Because he think he all important and shit. I ain't gonna lie, bro. But, but, but anyways, we keep moving on. We end up running into Grindel of the Ashes and the Frost. Two giants, once again, smoke they ass. I'm not gonna lie. And we end up running into Sentry. This nigga Atreus is getting ahead of himself, bro. He was talking spicy to him. Talking about, yo, we don't care about your problems. Problems. We don't care about little people's problems. I'm like, oh my god, why are you talking to him like you're not two foot tall? So we finally <laughs> run into this motherfucker Modi, bro. And Modi is apparently Thor's son, and Thor don't beat the shit out of him, yo. He's on his last leg. This nigga Atreus is like, I'm about to smoke this nigga. I'm like, no, son, don't do that, nigga. Don't kill him. Atreus, let me go like that. I'm about to smoke this nigga because you already know what it is. So he stabbed this nigga. I'm like, yo, what the I'm like, yo, yo, chair, like, what you doing? And I call like that. I ain't fucking with this nigga. Then he already know what it is. What's up? This is on crit. He kicked this nigga <laughs> down a motherfucking hole. I'm like, oh my god. After this, I'm like, bro, this can't get any worse, bro. And then this nigga Balder runs into us. I'm like, oh my god, bro. We uh -oh. trying to just get the uh, the, 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 the Jogenheim, Joheim, whatever the fuck Heim. You know what it is. We trying to get there, bro. This nigga pull up. Yo, we ram him into a wall and we break the gate. Yo, we use the like part of the gate to slam down on him. I'm like, oh my god. This nigga Trey has shot us, though. I'm like, bro, he mad at us. He shoot us. The thunder get me stuck. I'm paralyzed and shit for a second. He run up on this nigga Balder and got look up, hit this nigga dead in his motherfucking stomach. I'm like, oh my God. Mm. So at this point, we got to chase after him because this nigga got our son now. We fall on this dragon. We start motherfucking boxing on the back of this dragon. Like, I'm like, God damn, we fighting on Spyro? Like, what's going on? <laughs> so we going back and forth, back and forth, rolling around. We Dang, I kept it so quick. Tackle me. So we end up flying into this whole motherfucking the place where the world tree at. We still boxing. I ain't gonna lie, I used to buy frost and I take it straight to hell. We in the gate and shit. We flying in the hell. I'm like, yo, what is going on right now? This is crazy. We rocking this nigga while we flying. Blick -a, blick -a. Mm. Weave, weave, blick -a, mock -a, mock -a. We end up getting there and shit. We in hell on now. And this is what we find out about Freya being the mother of this nigga Balder, bro. She is the mother of Balder, bro. This nigga Balder is her son. And it's her fault. She made him invincible and made it so we couldn't feel anything. That's I'm like, wrong. oh no, nah, this bitch is different. So this is your fault the whole time. We watching this illusion happened, yo. He's like telling the illusion of him to like kill his mom. He's like, yo, kill that bitch. Kill her. Then he didn't do it. He's like, you soft ass bitch. He spit on himself. I said, oh, no, this nigga ain't shit. Mm -hmm. We end up seeing an illusion of me beating the shit out of Zeus, too. I'm like, man, I hope my nigga motherfucking hey, Atreus ain't see that. Whole time, I think he did, though. So we end up going back, and we got to get this tour to get the tears vault. The Sentry and Brock finally done made up, and they helping each other out and all that. Okay, I'm like, okay I like to see it. You know what I'm saying? Two brothers reunited yeah, and shit. Brother now we love. get the tears vault, and we find out that we need Momir's other eye. I'm like, oh, my God, bro. If it's not one thing, it's another, bro. So we go back to these niggas, and we like, bro, you know about this nigga eye? This nigga Sentry being soft as hell, gagging like, uh, uh, his eye, uh. I'm like, oh my God, bro, I ain't gonna hold you, bro. But he was like, bro, I ain't gonna hold you. You might have to look into the world serpent. I'm like, what do you mean, look in the world serpent? At this point, I'm like, bro, we done been everywhere else. Might as well go inside this nigga. Pause, that was crazy. Whoa. So we get to the world serpent. This nigga Momir start talking to the world serpent again, yo. I'm gonna translate. <clears throat> uh -oh. Hey, yo, my nigga Momir, what it do, nigga gang, gang? Hey, cuz, man, cut all that out, man. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. I need you to do something for me. What you need, bro? I got you anything. Bro, I ain't gonna lie. Right, bro, I need you to open that mouth up. Yo, pause. What the f hey, yo, what you mean you open my mouth up, cuz? Hey, cuz, I need you to open your mouth up. I need to go inside your mouth and all that. Yo, we got to get my other eye out. You feel me? Somebody told me my eye in there. Bro, I ain't going to lie. Your eye might be in there. But I don't know about y'all going inside me. Hey, cuz, you want me to call the Roshi Maru? Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Chill, chill, chill. I ain't going to lie. I would let two grown men and a little ass boy inside my body.
body before going Ooh. back to that nigga, bro. He is a weird, oh. deranged. Oh. Oh. Jamal has been sus since the beginning of the Elite Village, since the tuning exams. I, man, go ahead, man, go ahead. All right, cuz, bet. So at this back. point, pause. This nigga waiting back. with his mouth Those open, bro. Jamal Literally had his mouth wide stuff. open, waiting for to fly in it. I'm like, oh, no, this nigga different. So we go in this nigga mouth, and we find this nigga eye and shit, and we on the way back. But as we're swimming back, well, not swimming, but as we in the boat back, my fucking start shaking and shit. I'm like, what the fuck? This is a surf shop? We about, to, we about to catch a wave? Bro, this nigga water is outside punching the shit out of this nigga. The world surfing. So we end up flying out this nigga mouth. I'm like, bro, what the hell? This man border come walking out of the motherfucking water, bro. Not feeling nothing. And hey, this man Freya talking to him. Yo, this is tight, though. He is not trying to hear none of that shit. Okay. Ran straight up on his uppercut of the... Blue -ka, blue -ka, had a slogan in the sky like Billy Jean. This nigga, blue -ka, blue -ka, blue -ka. <laughs> nigga punched the tray as hard as hell, too. I'm like, God damn. But when he punched the tray, some of the his blood got on him. And I don't know if this nigga had like HIV blood or what. Like, I ain't, can I say that in the video? I don't know, man. Maybe I should have censored that. I, I don't know, man. Man, but man, that's neither any order at all. Yeah, Anyways, this blood got right, on him man. and shit. This nigga start turning vulnerable. I guess the his blood done redid or undid whatever spell was making him not have any okay. feeling. I'm like, oh my God. So now that he's vulnerable, we start scrapping this nigga. Bro, because he can feel now. And I ain't gonna lie, he's like on some masochist shit. He's like, yes, finally, I can feel again. I'm like, yo, oh, this nigga's weird. Like, bro, this nigga gets turned on by this. We rolling around, punch each other again. Make it Makamuga. Weave, weave, roll, roll, bro. And I ain't gonna lie, this nigga is different though. He was choking Atreus with one arm and punching me with the other. I'm like, yo. But we break out and start comboing this nigga, bro. I slide up, uppercut. Big up, Atreus. Mm. Hit him with the bow. Mac up, ah, punch his ass. Mm. Biggie, biggie. Yo, this nigga Atreus jump up, hit him with the mink mink but with the boo mink mink i'm like oh my god we on the ground we start punching the shit out of him blink up, blink up, blink up. the world serpent come in he smacked motherfucking thymir yo thymir was tripping the whole time the big ass giant and then this nigga barter finally fall down yo his health low as hell we start choking this but Freya's like, please don't kill my son. Please stop. So we end up getting up. And I'm like, man, you're going to regret that, yo. Because this nigga probably going to try to murk you. I ain't going to lie. Right. So this nigga Freya, she get this motherfucking idea that, look, man, look, if you want to kill me and that's going to make you hold it, go ahead. I'll let you kill me. She walk in. She embraces me. Arms wide open. I'm like, what the hell? This nigga water choking the shit out of her. I'm like, yo, what is going on? Right. Of course, yo, we come up. Put this nigga in a mean L. This nigga yeah. like, what are you doing? You could have just walked away. And then we break this nigga. Neck, bro. I'm like, oh my god, bro. And the cycle of hatred continues, yeah. bro. Yeah, talk him out. We gonna stop the cycle of hatred. No, because now Freya mad as hell. Talking pain. about she gonna rain down hell on us. Or Hellheim, you feel me? <laughs> she mad at us. We <laughs> saved her life. I'm like, oh my god, bro. So we end up confessing to our son, though, at this point, because Freya's like, okay, but does your son know? Da, da, da. I'm like, oh, all right, bet, bet, bet. I'm gonna translate that. He was like, <clears throat> He's like, son, I'm gonna come all the way clean with you, dog. Yeah, you like, hey, man, I, I killed my dad. He's like, dad, what the fuck you mean? You killed your dad? Like, like, <laughs> I would've killed you, like, like, what, what you mean by that? Like, you killed your dad, like, like, like Zeus and all that? Like, yeah, son, I smoked that, bro. I ain't yeah. gonna lie, I threw the chaos blades down. I get it, the straight hands. I hit it with that Mickey Mark up, you feel me? Damn, damn, with the straight hands? You hit it with the right hand and the left? <laughs> like, yeah, bro, I hit that with the right hand and the left, you feel me? Yeah. Then the right and the left again, and then the right and the right and the left. And like, I ain't gonna lie, I hit this like a sock and bopper, like I had the hawk hands on. God damn, damn. So I'm gonna end up smoking you. He's like, nah, son. You're gonna be better than me on folks. You feel me? You're gonna be a real nigga. You feel yeah. me? You're not gonna do that to me. Like, I'm not, I'm not capping. Like, you're gonna be a way better version of me. Like, you know what I'm saying? You short and all that. You know what I'm saying? Midget and all that, but you a real nigga. Hey, yo, dad, yo, stop playing. Just stop calling me short. Yo, if I smack this shit out you. Anyway, but anyways, they ended up making up, you feel me? And he confessed that he killed his dad. And I'm like, okay, okay. At this point, Freya leave all. She got bought her body. Nobody care about her. But we gonna spread these ashes and find out that this motherfucker had knew about everything the whole time. Everything that we did in this game was prophesized by these giants. I'm like, yo, what that's is happening? Crazy. How did this even happen? Shit was crazy, bro. And then we go home. And that's like the end of the game, for real. Except for my son had a dream that Thor showed up. And I guess that's gonna be a part of whatever the next game is, bro. This nigga show up. My okay. show us Mjolnir and shit. Like, I ain't gonna lie. He showed us Mjolnir like he was trying to show us he had a blicky on him. Like, you know how he run up on him? And then he show you the blicky real quick to let you know. Like, yo, run up and get done up. That nigga did that, bro. But he had a hammer with thunder on it. I'm like, oh, yeah. This different. I don't even want to fuck with this. I'm going to come all the way clean with you. Bro. But, but you asked me that you were there. Yo, this game was insane. A lot happened in this motherfucking game, yo. And, and, and I ain't going to lie. It took me mad long to get this. Oh, you feel me? Video recorded and all that. Audio edited and all that. The video edited for y'all. So like, I need y'all to support me. Make sure that you go to you. Uh, feel me in the pinned comment and follow me on Twitch. And you subscribe to that motherfucking gaming channel, yo. Because I need y'all for that. I need y'all to support me and all that. Anyways, that, that's it, though. Yo, Kratos, was that good enough? That, that was cool with you? Like, uh, that whole recap and shit? Yeah, I ain't going to lie, man. I was, that, was a, that was a good retelling. Like, I with that, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? I don't like how you had, you know, my son saying he was gonna smack the shit out of me and shit, bro.
because that's not even what happened. But feel me. Other than that, though, like that was some real <laughs> shit. Hey, man, I'm just glad I got to tell your story, bro. God of War Four is kind of fire, yo. Hey, by the way, I heard Ragnarok about to come out. Yeah, it's supposed to come out like this year, like next year, or something. Like, I mean. You did a good job with this one. Is you spinning the block on it? Like, you about to do the Ragnarok video? I ain't gonna lie, man. The only way I'm doing that Ragnarok video is if this video gets like 15,000 likes, yo, and at uh, least 200,000 views, like, done. at the minimum. You feel me? Done. Nah, real nigga shit, real nigga shit. But hey, Kratos, you ever, you still got that Tinder app? Yo, what's up with the bitch? Like, hey, man, you know I got the bitch, boy? <laughs> War is inevitable. Oh, 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 War never changed. Oh, oh, sorry, y'all. Sorry about that. Oh, my goodness. Well, as you saw, man, that's my reaction to his re-upload of the Kratos video, man. That was an amazing job, Sensei, man. Appreciate you, bro, so much, man. Taking the time to do all that editing and stuff like that. I know that was not easy. Fire video. Um... Please, everybody, subscribe to Sensei's video, man. Like he said earlier, he does a multitude of things. He raps, voiceovers. He does it all, man. He does it all. And on that note, I know this is my, probably one of my longest reactions ever, man, but it's all good. It's worth it. Please, subscribe to my channel. Like. Also, before I go, I rap to hip-hop music and anime. Leave a comment under the video on what you want me to react to next. On that note, I'm out. One love.